The Trump campaign is back in West Michigan today, one day after vice presidential candidates J.D. Vance and Tim Walls went head-to-head -head in their first and only debate. Vance made a stop in Metro Detroit before heading this to Marne late this afternoon. Political reporter Rick Albin has more from his rally at Berlin Raceway. Republican vice presidential candidate J.D. Vance came to Marne here to Berlin Raceway just one day after his debate with Minnesota Governor Tim Walz. And when he got here to talk to this crowd, that debate was clearly on his mind. The, the, the debate moderators tried to fact check me on this yesterday. They said, they said, what? You know, because here, here's one of the things I've seen, and I've seen this in small towns in the state of Ohio. I've seen it in Pennsylvania. I've seen it in Michigan. When you let in thousands upon thousands of illegal immigrants who have no legal right to be in this country. Now, of course, you got to put those people somewhere. So you've got illegal aliens competing with Americans for scarce homes. And what does that do? That drives up the cost of housing for a lot of young American families. With just about a month to go before the election, Michigan remains very tight, as do a handful of other battleground states. And that's what you're going to see both of these campaigns between now and Election Day, even though now it's really election season, as absentee ballots have already gone out in Michigan and a number of other states. In Marne, Rick Alden, News 8.